We got the Diamondback DB15. I'm going to show you how to rem attach, well, remove and attach the handguard for this Diamondback DB15. Okay. So check this out. Taking it off is easy. Putting it back on, there's a trick to it, but it's easy as well. It's super easy. So then you're gonna get a 3 16 Allen wrench. Take that out. So when you slide it out, be real careful because I'm gonna show you. this guy right here that's what holds it square holds it in place so if you look down in there there's where it goes so now we'll just slap it back on it's going to be super easy so you can't do it vertically like a lot of them but you can't do it vertically like a bunch of them because this will inevitably fall out You can't put it in there like that because it will fall out okay so in order to do it what we're gonna do is take it put it in that middle hole there and it sits right down in there okay I hope you can see it, it sits right down in there in that hole right there okay and that's as simple as, it's as simple as that. As long as you keep it like this, it you can slide it right on. Locks right into place. This is directional. There's only one way to put it in. Seat it right in there. All that's left is the shouting. Slide it in. That's all there is to it. Torque it down to the torque specs, and we'll do that. That's a whole different story there. Um, anyhow, that's it. I know you're. I know what you're thinking. Those fucking nasty ass flip up sights don't match. They don't match. They're coming off. I just wanted to. I only. I only had those. I'm gonna put some black ones on. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. I uh, got more coming. S hit that subscribe button. Hit the like if you like it. I like videos that get straight to the point. I try to get straight to the point. This is a Diamondback DB15. Um, yeah. Hell yeah. So, thanks for watching. Stay strapped or get clapped. Peace the funk out.